will be eliminated and reveal their true identity to the judges. And two will secure their spots in the finale. I'm really curious, how do you see yourself pushing yourself tonight? Well, I've been working my butt off. And everything that I do is for one moment because I want to show why I am the next generation superstar. Wow. Let's hear you sing. All right. Everyone's been revealing much more about who they really are. Mm -hmm. We can taste it. I just want to say, at this point, I think you should be feeling really good. This is, um, oh, huh, I didn't even mean to do that, but, um, <laughs> uh, like, literally. Hold on one second. Can I just, did I just hear Grimes make a pseudo dad joke? No, I didn't. It was accidental. Am I, am I rubbing off it was accidental. It was accidental. Some of the best ones are. Um, but to me, Seven, you, you are on the wave of the future, and that was totally fire, and I'm gonna say yes to you going on the diamond. Are you ready for tonight's performance? I am. I am very ready for tonight's performance. You know, uh... <laughs> this performance means a lot to me, because... I, I, I've been told my whole life that... <sighs> that I... We'll never make it as a singer because of the way that I look. And I just want to prove everybody wrong. And I, I want everybody to know that. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I'm so proud of your, your conviction. Thank you. And I, I stand connected and believe in the theory that music has no shape. Or music is not supposed to have a shape. Yeah. Judges, what did you think of Safar's performance? I thought that was fire. Yeah, the power you have in your voice when you're up there, that's where you excel. I think we've seen a lot of growth. I mean, you've really, you, you've come so far. Uh. Well, I'm curious, too, how do you feel like you've raised your, your level this week? I brought something unique today uh, because the meaning of this song is a little more specific. Basically, when I was a child, I, I lost a big portion of my childhood, and that's something I'll never get back. So the, the message of the song is from my younger self to me now, telling me to let go because he would probably want me to just be happier and moving on is the only way to do that. Wow. That's awesome. What would it mean for you to, to win the whole thing? It would mean a lot to me, actually. Um, I would pay off a lot of medical bills with the winning money, for sure. You have so many qualities and ways of performing that just really deeply resonate with me. So just hearing the idea of your younger part singing to your older part and, and asking to let go of something, the fact that there's even that inner dialogue going on inside you is... I would be in your audience, basically. I'd love for you to be in my audience. I like the suit. Oh, thank Looking you very good. much. I'm glad you're digging my Tux Cheeto this evening. Tux Cheeto. You like that? That's 24 karat Velveeta right there. <laughs> These are the semifinals. How have you elevated your performance? Well, first off, I've been lucky enough to work with some brilliant designers in this building to bring my vision to life. Let's give it up for everybody in this building, y'all. Orlando, are you ready to show us what you got tonight? I'm ready to show you. All right, let's do it, man. Yeah, I'm just excited. Your swagger was sort of bubbling up at the beginning, and then now I feel like your swagger's full-blown. Full-blown swagger? That sounds like a medical condition. Dipper Scott is officially going to the finale. Orlando DeVille, that means that you may be leaving the competition tonight. I will now ask the audience to vote for their favorite alter ego and the alter ego that receives the fewest number of audience votes will have to say goodbye tonight. I'm gonna have PTSD from the show. I can now confirm that the alter ego who received the fewest audience votes Becoming the first alter ego to leave us tonight is... C. 
Safara. What? 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 Safara, this is the end of your journey with us here on Alter Ego. Orlando DeVille and Seven, you are safe for now. What did you learn from Safara? I learned to be confident in myself and to love myself. Man, no matter what anybody has said about me. <laughs> Alanis. I'm just so excited for you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I just get really excited because when, when those voices in our head that sabotage us and hold us back step aside, then the real Mariah emerges. Yeah. And I am so excited for her. And that voice inside your head, what I would say to it is, thanks for trying to help her and protect her, but it's not helping. Yeah. And I got my confidence back. I got my happiness back. And that's, in, I mean, there's no money in the world that could buy that. Could have said it better. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Judges, it's time for your votes. The alter ego who gets the most votes will head to the finale. I keep coming back to the phrase you use, next generation superstar. And when I think about all the ingredients that we've talked about that make up that next generation superstar, I just feel like, I feel like Seven is more poised to step into that role. So I vote to send Seven on to the final. Seven. I still feel very compelled by your performance and by who you are as a, an alter ego, and I want to know more. And that counts for a lot for me, so I'm going to choose seven. I have to go with what makes my heart feel a certain way. The complete package was there. So I'm going to vote to send seven to the finale. Chase. Good to meet you, Chase. Good to meet you, too, Mr. Nick. Look, it was obvious as Orlando DeVille, it was just as obvious as Chase that you just love to entertain. You know what I mean? Like, you have a gift. That is the truth. Chase, what originally brought you to Alter Ego? Well, for my whole life, I've been told I had this voice made for the stage, but a face made for IT. And... Oh, my God. It, <laughs> It's funny, because it's true. <laughs> He's a hottie. I don't know what anybody's talking about. Is there anything that you would like to say to Orlando DeVille before you go? Mr. DeVille, I will take it from here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>